So yesterday, uh, I was looking for two movies that I only rented once at the video store from back in the day. Because I always remember the VHS covers and for years and years and years, I never knew what their names were. But I finally found it, found them out. Uh, before I tell you the titles and the movie itself, I'm just going to describe what the picture or the cover looks like. Or the VHS cover, by the way. One movie came out in 1988. It had uh, George Kennedy, you know, from the Naked Gun films. It was about this, uh, you know, this cat that had this little monstrous cat in it, you know, an 80s horror film that killed people on a yacht or a boat. And the other one, I always remember the cover of the of, of the poodle. <laughs> it came out in the early 90s, but it's about, uh, you know, about mutant zombies or demons, but the poodle on the cover, I always remember it. All right, hold on a minute, and I'll tell you what the films are. From 1988, Uninvited, about this uh, laboratory, laboratory experiment with this monstrous little ugly kitten. And it, the kitten somehow gets inside of a house cat's body. And the house cat, like I said, I only saw this once. And I don't remember the the whole scene. And I was real little. Even though I do have a photographic memory, you know what I'm talking about. Anyway, what I remember, they, the cat got on the boat. It was a house cat. But I don't know how, but sometimes the, the monstrous little kitten that was inside the cat came out and killed the people. I always remember that. I saw the trailer for that last night on YouTube. And the other movie is called The Boneyard. It's a direct-to-video movie from 1991. Nowadays, almost all videos are direct to, you know, DVD or video or whatnot. I don't remember if both of these movies came out in theaters, because I was young anyway. But anyway, <sighs> I always remember the cover cover of The Boneyard about the poodle, the ugly monstrous poodle. I just re always remember that. That's why I was trying to find the movie. When I was searching for it on uh, Google, uh, The Boneyard, I, I typed in, a, you know, uh, the movie about the poodle, a uh, killer poodle on the cover, and that, that's where this, I mean, I'm sorry, and that's where The Boneyard uh, came up. I did the same thing when I was writing, I typed in the horror movie about the cover of the cat or demon cat or whatnot. And that's when Uninvited came up. So that's how I, because of my photographic memory, I always remember that from written only once these two films from back in the 90s. Had to be like 92, 93. No, it was 1994. I'm sorry. It was, uh, I remember I written Uninvited from 1994 when my mother, when she was alive, uh, she had one of the trailers she lived at. I always remember that. And I watched that v VHS of Uninvited in her bedroom, and when she saw that, she was like, oh. The Boneyard, I can't remember, I'll guess 94, 95, or 93 in that time, or 96, you know. This was a hot before the DVD, uh, DVDs were getting made, so. The Boneyard is about this psychic lady who's got to solve this murder case that, I don't know, it has some kind of thing to do with a curse and this weird lady that owns a poodle. And these corpses become zombies and demons. I only saw this once, and I really didn't watch it for some reason. You know, I was a weird autistic kid. But I always remember the poodle that saw uh, something before. And at the end of the movie, I saw the trailer of this last night. Where the the poodle licked the zombies' uh, mutant bodies or whatever. Or, you know, when the zombie gets killed, they turn into like ooze. And when the poodle was licking it up, that poodle became a giant zombie demon. You know, so those are the films that I always remember as a kid because of the VHS covers. Thank God I looked them up last night and found out who they were. Maybe I might buy them. Sorry. I'm sorry. Maybe I might buy them on Amazon. I don't know. I've been thinking about ordering some new movies on Amazon again. Old classic horror movies or comedy movies. And I might order uh, Uninvited in the Boneyard if I see them on if they're on DVD, if they if they are on DVDs, I might get them. Or if they if they're out of print, it might be expensive, like thousand, two thousand dollars. You know, when you get DVDs, you're trying to find a movie, and they're they're out of print. They cost a lot of much money. I mean, they cost a lot of more money. Like this one book, I tried to get on Amazon, but it was it was a shit ton of shit ton of money, like a lot of dollars 
I think it was one hundred eighty dollars. I forget. I'm just guessing. That sometimes happens when movies you want to buy they're just too damn expensive to get. But it, but yeah, if I see a uninvited from nineteen eighty eight and uh, the Bone Yard, I forget. I forgot to say. Uh, Norman Fell, who was on Swiss Company, was in that movie as uh, the morgue. Uh, what was he? Uh, one of the doctors. I think he was the one who worked in the morgue. I can't remember. But if I find these movies on Amazon for a low or nice price, I'll buy them. Uh, because I just remember them from back in the day. And there was a lot of other VHS movies I remember. Most of the covers, I just can't remember who they were. But because of the how the covers were, or the pictures on the VHS cover, I will always remember them. Thank God for this so photographic memory. Thank God for that, man. I also remember at the time when I was looking at the cover of the Boneyard and Uninvited, I saw the uh, the original Boogeyman from the 1970s. I think that cover had uh, something to do with an apartment building or something. Maybe you see the picture of an apartment building in the movie titled The Boogeyman. I always remember that. And I think I saw the movie Slaughterhouse uh, by that guy and his fat, uh, mentally insane son. You know, the cover had him about to kill this girl who was half naked. And you just see her backside. You probably know what I'm talking about, but yeah. Man, you just remember stuff like that when you're a kid. You love going to the VHS store. I mean, video store. That they just had the VHS tapes, and you just remember stuff like that. It kills me sometimes. Anyway, about to end this video, and please subscribe to my channel. You don't have to like me. You don't have to respect me. Just subscribe to my channel. I need more subscribers. Anyway, that's it. I'm out. Peace.